In Moto 12.1 there has been a major update to the UV pack command. A brand new algorithm has been implemented, resulting in faster packing times in most cases. The distance between UV islands and also the distance between the UVs and the UV border can now be much more accurately controlled with the gaps by pixel option. This uses the defined texel density setting to define the spacing. There is now an option to pack to a new UV map, preserving the original. And a major addition is the ability to pack based on polygon tag. By setting the polygon tag type to either material, part, selection set or smoothing group, UV pack will pack the UVs to separate UDIMs based on that tag. So if material is used, each material will be packed to a separate UDIM, with UV islands being split if they contain multiple materials. And by using the new pack to new UV map option, each material will be packed to a new UV map. Some additional settings have also been added to the Mesh Fusion Surface Strip feature added in Modo 12. The new Strip Only mode causes Mesh Fusion to only evaluate and produce the strip geometry, reducing memory usage if only the strip geometry is required. In addition, two new properties provide greater control over the topology that surface strips generate. Absolute quad length in combination with the strip length absolute setting allows you to define the length of each polygon in a strip on a global basis and this can also be overridden on a per strip item basis if required. And the perpendicular recovery options allow you to control how quickly strip edges return to perpendicular near a strip intersection, giving you an incredible amount of control over the topology that Mesh Fusion surface strips creates and providing clean geometry that can be utilized for any post-fusion modeling with either direct or procedural tools.